So as you use Pro Tools more and more, eventually you're going to have to default your I.O. Now sometimes you have to default your I.O. because maybe you switch interfaces. Maybe you have two or three or four interfaces and you're switching back and forth. Maybe you've created a custom path. Uh, maybe some sort of glitch happened or you had to reinstall Pro Tools and your in-out path that you had before was all messed up. So right now I have an 11 rack hooked up as my interface. And even though I have chosen 11 rack as the I.O. template, when creating this session, You'll see it's not correct. You see, I have no output here. The input looks correct, but the output is not. And even though I have an 11 rack, and I chose 11 rack, you see that not everything always will mesh correctly. But it's a real easy fix. So to default the I.O. in Pro Tools, we'll just come up here to Setup, I.O., you see Output tab, and all we need to do is click Default. There's all other kind of options you could do in here, but for this video, we just want to default. So we'll default our path. Go to the Input, We'll also default our path. Bus, we'll just default these, default everything else while we're at it. And that's good. Click OK. Now we have our output correctly. So if you're in Pro Tools and you're having a routing issue, make sure you come up to your setup, I.O., and check your input, output, and you may need to default your path or make other changes.